what have they added here? You probably know it. You read on the back of the pack, and there's a confusing list of names of things you don't quite know what they are. For example, this here, stabilizer. Now, what's that? Well, with stabilizers, it's actually quite simple. A stabilizer is, in fact, an ingredient that stabilizes our food and ensures that the texture is as it should be. In other words, it's the stabilizer we can thank for our food not separating. You know it from chocolate milk, which makes sediment. <laughs> Ooh, we just don't want that. So you have to stir or shake it like this. <sighs> it is here that stabilizers act as a nice little helper, because if there is a stabilizer in it, then you don't need to shake the bottle so often. Stabilizers can also make something less fluid and more cohesive. It is thanks to stabilizers that jam can hang over the edge of a slice of bread without dripping on your clothes. Oh, no. Or mayonnaise, which can be squeezed out of the tube in a long, cohesive strip rather than in small lumps. Yuck. Stabilizers are also important in low-fat products, such as low-fat ice cream and dressing. Fats help to add volume and texture, so when you remove the fat, you've got to add something else that adds volume and texture. Without a stabilizer, the texture of ice cream, for example, would be quite wrong and collapse. Yes, something like this. And a low-fat dressing would almost pour out of the bottle like water. Oops. Stabilizers are natural products. They come from either plants or animals. A good example of a stabilizer from plants is pectin. Pectin was discovered by a French chemist called Henri Braconneau way back in 1825. It is extracted from citrus fruits and is used today, for instance, to stabilize jam. Gelatine, on the other hand, is made from fish skin and pig or ox hide. Gelatin is used in the kitchens of the world. It is taken out as soon as fromage, mousse, cakes, and other sweets are to be made. However, whether you use stabilizers from plants or animals, the effect is the same. Namely, that they make our food keep its shape and texture, and it needed it. <laughs>